with the pain of Jacob's wrestling In the darkness with the fear In the darkness with the fear But he met the morning wounded with a blessing So in the night my hope lives on And when Elisha woke surrounded by the forces Of the enemies of God the enemies of God He saw the hills aflame with angels on their horses So in the night my hope lives on Alright folks, I'm just going to give you a little tour of the uh, church. Uh, it's uh, Thursday here, Thursday afternoon. Just a little update on where we're at. So as you can see, we've got some industrial equipment outside here from uh, the professional restoration specialists who are here doing some work to uh, just basically the tear out getting the junk out of the church, drying it out so it doesn't mold and that sort of thing. So they got some heaters going in there. We'll take a look inside the church building. And uh, they had to cut holes through the floor here to uh, go down into and get the heaters down so they can dry out the basement. They're going to have to remove all of this tile here because there was water underneath there in the floorboards. And then we'll go in here and take a look in the uh, overflow area. All the carpet's been taken up because it was wet and there was water up on the walls so they had to take the um, some of these wall boards off as well you can see yep. and then going in here into the sanctuary the uh, the seats have been taken out the pews have been taken out some of them will need to have some work done to them to get them dried out uh, again the walls are being torn apart because moisture got in there you can see the floor is still damp they're going to have to pry up even these boards here and get down right to the very original flooring and dry that out because of all the moisture here, but it's quite a mess. Water was up. You can see where it's damp there along the water line. You can see it's still wet. So that's how high up the water was in here. A lot of electrical equipment's been lost and uh, it's quite a mess. Quite a mess indeed. Even on the stage, there's even moisture underneath the, uh, the staging here, so that all has to be uh, dried out as well, so it's, uh, it's a lot of work. Now I'm going to go down and just show you the basement. This is the back stairwell that would lead down to the kitchen. It's going to dark, be dark down here, but water. This, this was full right up, you know, this was sitting in water completely. And... Uh, Here's what the kitchen looks like now. Filthy, absolutely filthy. Everything has been removed from here. The ceilings are totally destroyed too. Cupboards are all gone. And then you can see the bathrooms. Hello, I'm just taking a video. We've got our trusty volunteers here working hard. Clearing things out. Everything is pretty much wrecked. Everything that's down here is has to be thrown out. Nothing is keepable. So here's here's the basement. See, there's still water on the floor. It's been hard to get the water up. And uh, going in, this is be the back entranceway up to the main uh, set of steps. Here's the old uh, nursery. Nursery no more. Now it's a disaster zone. All of this uh, pink insulation that was in the floor was dripping wet. It was absolutely soaked with water. This is what we're looking at. Oh, in the night, my hope lives on. Oh, in the night, oh.